We are here at Academy Mortgage, powered by Guild, and I am with Matt. Matt, how's it going? Doing awesome. How are you? I'm doing awesome Good. as well. It's always great to be here with you. Good to be here. And today, we're going to talk a little bit about some of the benefits of buying new construction. There really are some things to think about. There are some differences between new construction sure. or resale. So why don't you sort of talk to us about you know some of the things that, that maybe you should consider? Yeah, I hear a lot from our buyers, like what drives you new construction versus resale? Well, number one, you know, inventory is tight out there for resale. It just is. Sellers are not willing to sell right now, but also they want to go into something brand new. They want to add their options. They want to customize it to their liking and be able to pick from different floor plans. So those are some of the main reasons pushing them in the new construction route. I think too, with the new construction, people, you know, a great thing to consider is when you typically have a builder warranty, Absolutely. that if anything was to go wrong with the home, it's covered. And then also, especially if you're a new, a first time home buyer, you may not realize all the expenses of the systems yes. in your house, like your air conditioning, maybe your plumbing, even like your roof. And a lot of those things are very expensive. Yep. If you're, you know, if you're buying a resale and they're older, but if you're buying something new, obviously all of that is new as well. So you're, you've got more cash in your pocket and not having to spend absolutely. Right, when you're buying yeah. new construction. No, absolutely. And to your point, you know, builders are pushing incentives in many cases. Yes. Lenders, lender, lender partners are helping with incentives. So it's keeping costs low. Because um, you're right, a lot of times when people go into buying a home, they don't think about potentially a home that's 10, 15, 20 years old, all the updates and repairs and things that they might have to improve just to get it how they like it. New construction, you're not dealing with that. You're also able to go in and say, hey, I've got a lease ending in six months, so I'm gonna make this work for my current life, my current situation, and find something that I can build over the next five to six months and that timing works out well. Yeah, I hadn't even thought about that. That's a great point. And you know, let's talk a little bit more about those incentives because yep. you know, I've seen that on the builder side as mm -hmm. well and, and different builders are offering different things. What are some of the things that you're seeing right now? So we're, we're definitely seeing builders help with closing costs. You know, on our end, we're helping with closing costs as well. And, and what that ultimately means is, you know, sort of the narrative right now is it, it may be a good time to buy, but you have this, you know, whole narrative around interest rates. Well, you know, builders are working with their lending partners on saying, okay, we'll beat that too, right? Let's offer some incentives so we can buy down the rate, um, whether that be temporary or permanently, and it makes it affordable going in. So we're, you know, we're winning in that regard and not having to worry so much about interest rate. Yeah, I love that. Well, if somebody out there is maybe considering new construction and would love to know about maybe some of the programs or partners that you have with yeah, some builders absolutely. around town, what's the best way to get in touch? Yeah, just give me a call 770-856-5338 and we're happy to put you in touch with some awesome new construction communities.